Florida is about to finish its inaugural year as a center for international studies. So what is that? Ford is one of 30 schools around the country that's part of the Asia Society's International Studies School Network. That means that whenever possible, curriculum is a global perspective. We checked in with three classrooms at Fort to see what that looks like on an average school day. Fort Vancouver's culinary arts program lends itself perfectly to the school's global curriculum. They're learning not just how to slice and dice, but where their favorite foods come from. On this day, a pair of students present their research into the cuisine of Russia. We spent a couple weeks on preparing a, like a PowerPoint and we're, I presented that today to my class and I think they enjoyed it. These future chefs are opening their horizons as they figure out their culinary point of view. Basically what I was doing was telling my classmates how the culture and how my cooking style is in Russia the, from different from like how would I do it in the U.S. Over in the English language learners classroom, students hail from all over the world. Mexico, Italian, Ukrainian, Chinese, Korea, Vietnam, Moldovan, Russian. I'm from Russian. <laughs> They're all speaking English, the only common language in the room. Since they all came from someplace else, they share their genuine, diverse cultural experiences with each other in PowerPoint presentations. Seven writing pieces and I think 28 art pieces. In another room, students critique artwork and writing by their classmates, which was created for a contest by the Oregon Jewish Museum and Center for Holocaust Education. I think the biggest benefit for them is it does really help them to recognize perspectives in a global environment. I think it makes you more open-minded because mm -hmm. sometimes ignorance is the uh, reason for all hate so people get to understand what other cultures are like, what yeah. other religions are like. Awareness, mm -hmm. okay. awareness is really like gonna eradicate all hate. And it really helps them to create empathy um, at a time when the world is so tumultuous. I think growing compassionate human beings is our highest calling. The Center for International Studies also offers volunteer, travel, and other opportunities for students.